And we're turning to this story. We're highlighting people doing amazing things in our community. Dozens of high school girls are making sports history right here in Arizona. High school girls flag football is now officially being recognized by the Arizona Interscholastic Association for the first season in state history. Jen Wall hit the field with the Williams Field High School team. She's joining us live to share their competitive game plan. Jen, tell us about this. Yeah, good morning to you, Emily. It is so awesome being out there on that field. These girls are not messing around. It is all women supporting women. And the season officially started back in August. So really exciting there. There are a lot of teams across Arizona and we were able to catch up with the Williamsfield High School team to see how they pull it all off. Now they played a little while in the spring, but this is the first full season that they're playing and officially recognized by the AIA. Go ahead and take a look. Go. Senior quarterback Addison Nichols and senior wide receiver Amber Farron. Post, shoot in. Scoot in, scoot in, scoot in, scoot in. Have deep roots in flag football. I played flag football in the league when I was like four to like seven or eight. I need my quarterback. <laughs> Amber's dad now coaching her Williamsfield High School girls flag football team. I love it. I'm glad that he did it. I, I thought it was a great idea from the start. Let's go one on ones. Bob Farron, Amber's dad, is the offensive coordinator. We tell the girls there's a lot of opportunity for girls in flag football because these coaches in colleges are going to give scholarships to the to the ones that can academically do it and athletically do it, right? Go. Female head coach Yvette Christensen has one important message for her all-girl team, a team that is officially sanctioned by the Arizona Interscholastic Association for the very first time. I really want my girls on this team to understand how much of a privilege and honor this is and that they are starting something that might be huge is what I'm hoping for. Her motivation when coaching every practice and game. And I want these girls to experience Friday night lights as well. It may not be on Friday, but just to have that energy behind us. That energy brought to the field every time with her Lady Blackhawks. They hit the field for 12 games and playoffs that start at the end of October. Quarterback Nichols taking every game seriously through then. It's not just all me and my team. We're all a team. Everyone has to do their part. Everyone has to show effort and it works. Nichols and the Blackhawks taking down one game at a time. They see that it's an opportunity. It's fun. Get to learn something. And I think that it's really cool that AIA made it a sport. Until the goal of hitting the November state championship in Arizona. Okay, and Williamsfield tells me they really want to be at that state championship, so they're working hard towards that. Now, the playoffs are going to be in October. Williamsfield played in the spring, and again, this is the first full fall season sanctioned by the AIA with that state championship game coming up on November 4th. There are 55 teams across Arizona and 25 girls on the Williamsfield team and growing right now. And guys, before we send it back to the studio, I want to let you know, so our photographer Mike, his daughter, is on this football team. He says they just absolutely blew out Tempe last night, 38 to zero. So they're off to a great start.